Now in this video I'm going to be talking about the wages in the oil and gas industry but uh, specifically in the North American industry so if you're, if you're looking for my video that's uh, on the same topic uh, for the Australian industry then uh, firstly if you're on Facebook or YouTube watching this video click on the link to go over to my blog post and there you'll find a link to my other video on the Australian industry and, um, and it's actually uh, probably a, a better topic to cover in the Australian industry because there's a lot less variables in the US um, you know that's, there's a much bigger scale of you know lower wages all the way up to the higher ones as well and so many more variables uh, depending on like the, the company that you work for where you're working uh, will um, make this change quite a lot so for example if you're going to get a job in the south of Texas the wages there are uh, nowhere near as good as they're going to be in North Dakota and um, and there's probably a number of reasons for that but uh, the other thing is too, like in Australia, it's pretty much standard across the board that people would work, you know, a couple of weeks or three weeks on and a couple of weeks off and um, always be like that, only working 12 hour shifts and, and so it's a lot more consistent. Whereas in the US, there's actually companies that will run three rosters of eight hour days. Um, so there's more employees, more teams of guys, uh, but people learning, uh, earning a lot less money. Um, so it really, it do, does depend. Um, so if you've heard all the hype about the kind of money that you can earn in the industry, I suggest then you um, take a bit of time investigating the, the different areas, first of all, the different locations. Um, but you know, if you're, if you're hell bent on earning a really decent wage, I suggest that you stick with uh, uh, going for North Dakota because the wages are going to be much better there.